Hey guys, welcome back to another new video. So in this video, we are going to have a look on Lumia 640XR. So this is a device released in 2015 with mid-range processor and uh, specs. So it got a, a very big, huge display, but 720p resolution and got one gig of RAM and eight gig of storage. Snapdragon 400, 1.3 gigahertz processor, and it was a quad core processor and quite good for a 2015 meter range device. So, got a 5 megapixel front camera and 13 megapixel back camera, which are not really great. And have 3.5 megapixel, uh, 3.5 mm headphone jack and a uh, micro USB uh, port. So, kind of uh, very good for 2015 meter range device. And I bought this device for uh around ten dollars and you may get this device around ten dollars nowadays but i kind of screwed up uh in this deal because i got a not really a great deal here because uh, the what the seller said it is not true here so i got a bloated battery and a, a broken front camera although i'm not going to uh take any selfie in this phone but uh and the battery is also holding power it is bloated but it is holding power maybe it was uh, kept a long time that's why the battery is bloated but the battery is holding power so so this device is uh, like 3g device and you may get like 4g 640xl which support lte so you can buy it for 10 dollars so why are you going to buy this kind of phone for 10 dollars it is kind of a dumb phone but but it is better than a dumb phone kind of so you can play games you can install games and you can listen to the music also you can make calls and text here and also you can watch youtube so this is kind of a good device for for the kids actually because you can't really install any apps from the store or you cannot browse uh, many things here you cannot go to facebook or you cannot install tiktok and other things you may be able to watch like youtube but it, it's very limited here so it's kind of good for like giving to the uh, kids so who are actually like to uh, watch youtube or play games so they can they can do it like for ten dollars it's not a big deal so for me i have a lot of uh, devices like this like lumia 540 and other things and this device i just bought to, just to keep actually for collecting so this device is very similar to Lumia 1520. Uh, I have reviewed that one. So kind of very similar size. Like, but 1520 has a very large display. And as you can see here, the display is very big here. But but the display on uh, 640XL is really good, and it has like Lumia Clear Black technology. So the colors really pop like a OLED panel. And it is really it has a really deep black maybe you can see from the from the video maybe so let's go and check what we can do with this device so as we, as I can say uh, like, like you can take from videos and it can take uh, 1080p videos with back camera even in from uh, with the front camera as I said my front camera is broken so I'm not going to try any kind of cameras and other things I'm really uh, going with like what you can do with this device so mostly i play games here so as you can see i have a lot of games because it has a big display and although it has a, like the pro, uh, the specs is not really great but windows phone really run very well on this mid uh, like lower specs so i have no issue with the games and other things in this device and phone call and messaging is re quite really good and one thing about windows phone is that uh, the keyboard is really good and I haven't found any keyboard which feels this much um, great in my uh, like in my Android and my iPhone I haven't found that it is really great keyboard and it is really uh, very good to type and you can type very fast on this so the device running very well on Windows 10 and it is really supported officially uh, like for Windows 10 and I have installed like the latest version of Windows 10 for it so if I go here and setting system about and you can see here that the version is running on like 17.03 which is uh, latest for this phone and it is running and you can see here like RAM and other word, everything here so this is running on 720p display and we have a 1 gig of RAM and 8 gig of storage which is very really rest for this device but 
you can uh, put your own SD card here so that and other things about this Windows Phone is that nowadays they have a like Windows Phone universal rule where you can go it is kind of a store for a Windows Phone you can go there and you can install any kind of apps for uh, which were available on our store uh, back then of, of before to the before they shut down their store so every apps which were available at the time you can download it from here so if I go here rip so let me wait to load the uh, app so it will load some kind of repo and you can go through the repo and you can look for whatever application you want so the application like um, whatsapp and other things will not work here like messenger and whatsapp but the offline games offline apps are working just fine here so maybe i need to update this device yeah yeah i have to update this application maybe that's why it's cr crashing right now but it does work perfectly fine and i have installed all the apps from um this um uh, using this app actually also you can install app like using your uh, pc or even if you have, if you have android phone you can directly use that so as you can see here it loads some app repo so all the games are here you can install like 626 games here you can install whatever is you want and if you go like here we have like uh xbox games all the xbox games are here you just need to download and it will automatically install so we think, let me block starts let me download this one and install this so it has started downloading now my internet is kind of slow so i have put it my sim card here and it is running on my sim sim data because my sim data are 4g but this device support only 3g so that data is kind of slow here yeah? although it is like 15 mbps speed on the internet speed is quite good on my android phone but here it's not that good so as you can see it is installing the game now and installing right now so it is quite easy actually um i think if this uh, app or a revival like in 2000 15 or 2016 maybe the windows phone could survive a bit more because everyone can install apps from there so installation done so it, let me check so it's, as you can see blobster is here so everything you need all the apps and games you can find from the the windows universal tool and if you want to install this tool i have made a video about it how you can install how you can unlock interpo and everything i have talked about that and i will put the link in the description if you want to check out that video you can check so basically this is kind of a dumb phone and really good kind of dumb phone for me because you can do many things here and also has a big display so if you want to watch some youtube videos you can still watch here and like texting and phone calls are working just fine also have a like a decent 13 megapixel camera although it's not really great although it has a gyse optics but it is really uh not really great actually i i have seen like lumia's uh like nokia lumia phone not microsoft nokia lumia phones has like much better camera like lumia 820 has much better camera than this although that one is 8 megapixel still is much better than this camera kind of although um, because as i said it is a mid-range device 820 is a flagship device from from lumia lineup it is quite good phone so that's it all about lumia 640 xl if you want to buy one of these you can buy but don't pay more than five to ten dollars it is really it will be really bad and uh, and you can do actually not much thing you can do with this device but still it's really great device to listen to the music and watching some videos and playing some games and for basic phone calls so that's it about lumia 640 xl thank you very much for watching and i will see you next time <music>